him, I adore him. Jesus, you are a high power, a tiny, a great defense. Jesus, you are a great defense, a warrior fighting. Lord, a mighty prince of peace, O Lord, Jesus, you are man, a bread of life, the bread of life for the people of God. Jesus, Jesus, you are a redeemer, a healer, a deliverer, a wholeness, a rock, a shield, a fortress, a refuge. Jesus, our Lord and Savior, Jesus, 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 Christ, my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, come and fall upon the children, come and fall upon the people of God. Holy Spirit, come and heal us and make us whole again. Make us powerful with your power, with your holy might. Oh, Holy Spirit, come, come upon all prayer warriors in the 2020 prayer team. Come, Holy Spirit, upon the 2020 prayer team staff, prayer team staff. Holy Spirit, fill us with your power, your holy fire. Holy Spirit, heal our broken hearts, heal our wounded souls, heal our wounded minds with your power and anointing. Holy Spirit, release your healing hand, your healing balm, your healing sob upon us, Holy Spirit, and Holy Spirit, heal me, my brother. Yeah. 
your healing hand, your healing balm, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, heal us now with your mercy and love and faith. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit, come. Hallelujah. 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 Father, I'm just going to now pray over us in the 2020 prayer team. I'm going to pray protection over us. I'm going to pray Psalm 121 and Psalm 91 in the King James Version Bible. And I'm going to pray these scriptures over all of us in the 2020 prayer team. And God is our keeper, it says. God is our keeper. Like a, a song of decrees in Psalm 121. Father God, I thank you that all of us, including myself, all of us in the 2020 prayer team and staff, will lift up our eyes into the hills for winds coming our help. Our help coming from you, Lord, which made heaven and earth. Father, you will not suffer our foot to be moved. You that keep it us will not slumber. Behold, you that keep it Israel to neither slumber nor sleep. I thank you, Lord, that you are our keeper. I thank you, Lord, that you are a shade upon our right hand. The sun shall not smite us by day nor the moon by night. I thank you, Lord, that you shall preserve us from all evil, and you shall preserve us, you shall preserve our souls. I thank you, Lord, that you shall preserve us from all evil, and you shall preserve our souls. And even preserving us from all evil of any type of slavery program, whether it's gang stalking or human trafficking, or sex trafficking, or anything like that, Father God. Anything evil, witchcraft too. And I thank you, Father Lord, that you shall preserve our going out and our coming in from this time forth, and even forevermore, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. So, Father, I thank you that you are our keeper and our helper, and you are our defense, Father God, our protector, our covering, Father God, and you are our warrior fighter, Father God, and you're fighting our battles for us, so we don't have to fight them, Father God, in the spiritual realm, Father God. So, Father God, I just thank you for your unconditional love for us, Father God, and for me as well in Jesus Christ's name, Father. So I just give you glory and honor in Jesus Christ's name. And now I'm going to praise Psalm 91 over all the prayer warrior 2020 prayer team and staff and viewers out there that, that pray for the 2020 prayer team from the Zep Daniel Report every month to the on the 20th of each month. Father God, I, I thank you according you to Psalm 91, we dwell it in the secret place of the to Most High that we shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. And we will say to you, Lord, that you are our refuge and our fortress and our God. And you will be trust, Father. Surely you shall deliver us from the snare of the fowler, which is the devil, and from the noise and pestle. I thank you, Father God, that you shall cover us with your feathers, and under your wings shall we trust, and your truth shall be our shield and buffer, Heavenly Father. I thank you, Father God, that we shall not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that fly by day nor for the pestilence that walk it in darkness, nor for the destruction that wastes it at noonday. A thousand shall fall at our side, and ten thousand at our right hand, but it shall, it, but it shall not come nigh us. Only with our eyes shall we behold and see the reward of the wicked. Because, Father God, you have made, because, Father, you have made, sorry, because, Father, we have made you, Lord, which is our refuge, even the most high, our habitation. There shall, no, there shall no evil befall us, Father. There shall, 
There shall no evil befall us, neither shall any plague come nigh our dwelling. For you, Father God, shall give your angels charge over us to keep us in all your ways. They shall bear us up in their hands, lest we dash our foot against a stone. We shall tread upon the lion and adder, the young lion and the dragon shall we trample under feet. Because, Father, you have set your love upon us, therefore will you deliver us, and you will set us on high because you have known our name. Father, we shall call upon you and you will answer us. And we shall call upon you, Heavenly Father, and you will answer us, Father. And you will be with us in trouble, and you will deliver us and honor us. For long life will you satisfy us and show us our salvation. Father, I thank you that your word is done in our lives, Father God, in the 2020 prayer team, Father God, prayer warrior team, Father God. In every day, Father God, in every day that we pray against this human trafficking in the 2020 prayer team, in the Zach Daniel report, and from the, the 2020 prayer team staff and prayer team warriors, including my life too, including myself too, Father God. And I thank you that your word is done in Psalm 91, verses 1 through 16. Father God, in our lives, in Jesus Christ's name, and thank you for being our divine protector and our refuge and our strength and that we put our trust in you, Father God, and that you are delivering us. You said in your word, what I just read in Psalm 91, that you will deliver your people. You will deliver us. You will answer our prayers, Father God. Father God, you hear us and you are with us in a time of trouble, Father God, and you will deliver us and set us on high because you know our name, Father God. You know everything about us, Father God, and what we're made of and what we're not made of, Father God. And Father God, that you will never leave us nor forsake us, Father. You're always with us, even in the time of trouble, and even you're close to the brokenhearted, Father God, and to the wounded and the hurt and the abused and betrayed and all that and abandoned and rejects and all that. And you will deliver us, Father God, and honor us. And you will deliver us even from any slavery programs. You will deliver the children from human trafficking programs and from perpetrators and Bullies, Father God, you would deliver us from covert gain stocking programs and over gain stocking programs because you are the mighty deliverer and you're more than able to deliver all your people, to deliver all the children and the innocents and the babies and stuff, Father God. And that you are more than able to deliver these babies from being killed in abortion meals too, Father God, to put a stop and adjudication to that too, to that murder. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, to that witchcraft and that Satanism, taking babies' lives and doing all kind of evil things and selling their body parts and stuff for profit and satanic purposes. In Jesus Christ's name, I thank you, Father God, that you're more than able to deliver the children from human trafficking and sex trafficking, prostitution, rings, pedophilia, Father God, peace, a gate, or whatever. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, I give you glory. And honor for setting your love upon us, Father God, and the 2020 prayer team and staff. And I thank you, Father, for giving us strength, the power to tread upon the lion and adder. The young lion and the dragon shall we trample under feet instead of it being the other way around. Father God, I thank you for giving us the strength of the warrior spirit to fight and to trample on devils and to trample on scorpions and to trample on lions and dragons, Father God, and snakes and stuff, Father God, that we pick up serpents, Father God, as believers in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I thank you, Father God. I just praise you, Father God, that you, no matter what comes near us, Father God, is not going to, what comes around us, rather, is not going to uh, come near us, Father God, it's not going to harm us, Father God, including the witchcraft too, Father God, including the terrorism and the evil people and the schemes and the games. And I pray that you would destroy every satanic scheme and plan and that the devil has plotted against our lives with your power and your anointing and with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name and that you would destroy every satanic plan that Satan has Plotted against my life too with your power and your anointing and the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. And I bind up the spirit of retaliation that come against us in Jesus Christ's name. I bind up the spirit of fear and terrorism and abuse and Satanism and witchcraft and Jezebel and Ahab in Jesus Christ's name. I bind up the spirit of torture and affliction 